Nollywood actress Omoni Oboli has revealed that she was that the ongoing protests have not been convenient for Nigerian entertainers and celebrities. The actress um, come filmmaker has also shared photos of herself on the protest ground alongside her industry colleague and friend Ufoma, appealed to Ni appealing to Nigeria to be gentle with the celebrities. Taking to her official social media page, she basically reiterates that the fact that they get a lot of pressure from high places for supporting the movement and that we should take it easy on her. Um, I don't know how you guys All right, feel so about for that. Me, for me, it, bo it still boils down to what I have been saying about our generation being less corrupt. I think I mentioned that to Daria did Daria mm. yesterday as well. But being they use less... Instagram, we go to train you. Yeah, but they use it to train us. It's, it's also, <laughs> right? We'll come back to that. To that one, we'll, that is story for another day. Don't let mm. us be doing That statement was very heavy, right? bro. Very, very heavy. But at the end of the day, I think it is still... It still boils down to the fact that, look, these people have not done us any favor. We do not owe them. This um, actresses, actors, most of them are movie producers and directors. They've had budgets, mm. right, that they had to meet up, right? And they've gone to meet one politician mm. or another that has funded their movies, right? So that politician has a right to call that, ah, 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 already. Come, calm down. Can you not be out there Speedy. for now? Do you understand? So we understand where these people are coming from, but it still takes us to the level of corruption in our country. Mm -hmm. So um, this statement from Momo Nyoboli, in as much as we want to be calm with you celebrities, can you also focus on private investors for your movies and don't go to these politicians mm -hmm. so that when it's time for election, they do not come back to you for you to come and cajole us to go and vote for you Momo, or speak to us. It's very easy to say that. It's one. very easy that, to see, say, but it is the truth. I think that's what we should be saying anyway, because regardless, what we really want is for the government to be involved positively in all our sectors mm -hmm. and not oppress us. Then they should not use. because you have seen that we are making money with Okada and you decide to bring policies to kill the Okada because you want to put your own Okada mm -hmm. on the road. Do you understand? We need them to be there to create an environment for us to work. So we cannot say we want to stay away from them. And for her coming out to say that um, it's being inconvenient for them, I mean, it's being inconvenient for a lot of us because mm -hmm. if you have a link to any part of the government, whether it's just an essay that is your friend, mm -hmm. or your friend is the best friend to the governor, Thank or you. they just have your phone number, they can call you to have these conversations. I don't think they are going to put a gun to your head to say um, you have to do this or you don't have to do this. You can do as little as just retweeting. So but you're coming making out, it look like you're indebted to them. But That's coming out like. to make the statement is absolutely unnecessary at this point because whether or not Oboli joins this movement or not, the movement is moving forward. It is mm. giving us results, and we're happy where we are right now and i think we can push for better reforms in every sector of the economy so this statement she's putting out on instagram i feel like they don't even know when to stop I think, they don't I know when to Insta keep quiet the, the, and that's the, the problem the air that the instagrammers are breathing are breathing is quite different from the air that twitter people are breathing because yeah. i feel like they get oh, a lot man, they get like too that. They get too lackadaisical with their thoughts and very flimsy and i think this what that's what this was i mean I understand to a, to a certain point what she means by like take it easy on people in terms of pushing people to really support and mm -hmm. be as you know as involved as you are. I feel like I even get that pressure as well. Like, mm -hmm. oh yeah, work. What are you doing now? Like, I'm, uh, I mean, I'm, people are losing their jobs for that, and I'm not gonna say don't do that, but I don't feel like I'm I'm really up for the idea of being pushed to give myself in, mm -hmm. in the same regard right. as everybody else. And I think that's where she was hinting from. So I understand what what she means by like pushing celebrity faces and like your 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 faves uh, to a, to a level you know of, um, of of joining i get that but then the idea of that it is inconvenient it's not a good I, word I, I, it's not, I, I, for it's not a good word to use but talking about twitter and instagram like you said i really want to give a huge shout out to um Jack twitter right yeah now yeah. i mean he gave it us a hash sense. flag for those who don't know hash flag is what you're calling the twitter emoji mm. so hash flag is like an emoji that mm. comes by um, they created for trends that, right. and that is very expensive. Mm. Now, if you Google it on the surface, they will tell you it's co it cost about one million dollars. Right. I don't know if it's up to that for one hash flag. However, it is pretty expensive, and it's not something any brand can just get. So, for him to, or for the platform to be to able to that. give that to Ensas mm. Movement, that's that's a, a lot of endorsement deal. and a lot of support and. Um, big shout out to Twitter. I mean, I don't know what Zook is doing, but <laughs> yeah. Zook is more I, more concerned about Joe Biden than Trump. But well, I like that we're recently having a conversation around social media and mm -hmm. the internet.